The month of May has arrived and the moon will be very present in this month's sky. Meteorologist Corey Smith explains what you'll see. We've made it to a new month, which means it's time to take a look at the night sky over the Midlands for the month of May. Before we get into things, let's talk about April because we got some great pictures once again from our nighttime weather watchers. Some gorgeous pictures of the moon across the region over this past month. And the moon is going to be a pretty big focus as we go into this upcoming month, starting off with this week, May 5th, the full moon will be visible, known as the flower moon for those absolutely gorgeous flowers we get in the May month or really just the springtime here across the region. So definitely a view that will be pretty easy to see as we go a little bit later on over the next couple of days. In the morning of April 9th, this is pretty early in the morning, around 3 to 5 a.m., the moon will be with the constellation Sagittarius near what is known as the teapot. So you can see these stars right here forming what looks like a teapot in the night sky. Very easy thing to find and a pretty cool sight to see in the morning hours of the day. As we go a little bit later on, also in the morning, May 13th, we're going to see the moon and Saturn in the eastern sky right before sunrise. So if you're out in those early morning hours, something to view there. But if you're more of a nighttime person, we also have something for you towards the end of the month. This is going to be May 23rd with the constellation Gemini, the planet Venus, and the moon. A little bit of a crescent moon right there in our western sky that's going to be right after sunset so pretty easily visible across the region we just have to hope that weather plays along nicely and speaking of the weather going forward this week not an issue at all high pressure is keeping things pretty quiet with plenty of clear and cool nights ahead some great weather to go take a look at our night sky and if you get any pictures any videos or if you have any questions or comments you can feel free to leave those on any of these social media pages you see right here next to me but until next time i'm from the studio news 19 meteorologist corey smith